They smell just like bacon rashes. Do you know the crisp of the bacon? Then frazzle. Do you know frazzle? Remember frazzles? They would. I'm going to find a picture of a bag of frazzles and stick it up somewhere so you can see them if you've never had frazzles. Welcome back once again to Rob's Homemade and Reviews outside the workplace on a gorgeous, beautiful, sunny, warm, 20 odd degrees today. Summer's here, but for how long? Not very probably. It's going to be cold, windy and wet again soon. So anyway, today it's snack time. Snacky, snacky, snack time. So... We went shopping, I think it was home bargains, I'm pretty sure. I do these things, I go shopping, I go in about four different shops, and when I come to record these videos, I can never remember which shop I bought what from. I need to start writing stuff down. Note to Rob, write stuff down. Anyway, today, like I said, snack time, we have. Oh, oh, lentil rings, maple, bacon, taste maple bacon taste now that's interesting these are vegan and vegetarian friendly so maple bacon vegan and vegetarian crisps it says taste not flavor which i'm kind of like yeah fair play you, you've not said them flavor they're not said them flavored they take it the maple bacon taste which is a weird one they look like some nice god onion rings 17% fat, 13% protein, 100 gram bag. These were made, as far as I know, in Lithuania. Never had, I don't think I've ever, ever had Lithuanian crisps before. If I have, I can't remember. But these caught my eye and I thought, you know what? Maple bacon, I do like bacon, I do like maple. So put them together on a vegan and vegetarian crisp. We shall see. John's not a big fan of anything that's supposed to be meat tasting that is vegan and vegetarian friendly because he says he reckons you can taste the complete difference anyway. So let's have a look at the ingredients. See, best before date as well, 18th of the 3rd, 2023. Is that because they're vegan, they last longer? I don't know. Maybe so. Anyway, maple and bacon taste red lentil. Red, li red lintel snacks ingredients red lintel flour 42 percent maize flour rice flour rapeseed oil seasoning mix of sugar wheat flour flavorings dextrose smoked salt yeast extract salt onion powder spice extracts herb and salt so there's no bacon flavoring it just says seasonings and spice extract so i'm not expecting heat in the slightest but i'm hoping for a bit of flavor taste like bacon all well and good if you don't I don't know if I want to hate these because they are vegan and vegetarian friendly I'm not ashamed to try anything different they smell just like bacon rashes do you know the crisp of the bacon then frazzle do you know fraz remember frazzles they would I'm going to find a picture of a bag of frazzles and stick it up somewhere so you can see them if you've never had frazzles they actually smell bacony if that's even a word so here goes some like miniature onion rings so here goes for lentil rings maple bacon taste from home bargains cheers guys First of all, you get a sweet maple taste. I want to hate these, but I can't. They have really good bacony flavour. There's plenty in this bag as well. It's kind of refreshing sometimes for a bag of piss. Because you know sometimes when you get excited for a bag, you open them and there's about 10 in there and you're like, that wasn't worth it. 
We had like little O rings. I seriously did want to slate these really bad and go from vegan vegetarian friendly that's why they don't taste of bacon they don't taste of maple they don't taste of nothing and bland and boring what a whore i really can't these are probably the best vegan and vegetarian friendly crisps i've ever had lentil rings maple bacon taste i would buy these again Like I said, first initial taste is that maple syrup, sweetness and sugariness. Then you get a decent crispy bacon taste. I can't know, I'll give you these. It says maple bacon taste, and that's exactly what you get, maple bacon taste. Obviously no heat rating today. But oh ho, lentil rings, maple bacon taste, get an eight from Rob. Damn good, damn really good. And I would definitely, even if you're not vegan or vegetarian, I'd recommend these as a bacon crisp because they do taste a lot like frazzles, which are proper bacon -y crisps. I'd even push to an 8.5 on flavour because the, the am really really moorish but I'm going to stop because I've got to go back in there and do a bit so anyway oh ho lentil rings maple bacon gets a big massive thumbs up from Rob would highly recommend if you do see him you like a bacon flavour you like a sweet maple grab yourself a bag you won't be disappointed flavour rating 8.5 in the end got up at 0.5 so I just want to say thank you very much for watching smash that like button hit that subscribe button when you hit the subscribe button don't forget the notification bell click all and you will get every single notification from me Rob of Rob's Homemade so from lentil rings maple bacon, maple bacon taste and me Rob thank you very much for watching Peace.